it's a good shit job I'm I'm there, because nobody else would have spotted that one, would they, eh? You'd make a good anti-submarine hunter, Steve. The thing is, it's so Over hazy. Oh, that's a first. Yeah, well that's why I said uh, oh God, lucky out here. pull over. That's a first. There's the old fort over there. Hey. Just showing it where the fort is. Yeah. Go. This is the first time. <laughs> Captured on camera. What's that? It's a good yeah, one, huh? Hey. Good little sneaky. I'll just show the old uh here. Here as well. There's someone sitting last night, river trenching in ice cream cones. Doing what? River trenching in ice cream cones. Never. Right, any steps to knock them down there? Where are they? Why is it today, Tuesday, you're sneaking out on the floor? Russian one. Soviet made gun was captured in northern Iraq by the Royal Marines during Operation Haven 1991. Can you get in him? Does it say what type it is or anything? Hang on, Chris, I'll get a good photo. Hey, Chris, get in there, and I want you to storm out. Storm out? Yeah, go on. With a yell. OK, go, let's go. Hit the beach. Hit the beach. Go on, hit the beach. Kill, die. <laughs> <laughs> All right, now the mode you down before you got halfway. What's that boat? Does it say what that one is? This is a rigid raider. Came into service in the Royal Marines in 72. Yeah. Small groups of commandos. Rigid raider, that one. You heard that. It says six troops, that adult. That is a Wessex whirlwind. What does it say about the helicopter then? That helicopter? XN299 in, in the foreground letter mark K, embarking Marines on the flight deck of HMS Bulwark, March 1960. That's the actual museum in there. 105mm pack howitzer of Italian design. 19.80. Might say inside. What that Italian one? No, it's the Italian. He's bow down. It's the cut of the steel. And quite a stuff, isn't it? Really. I 
kind of look around those seats as well. Yeah. Uh -huh. Well, they clapped me in irons for five days. It beats wells and ashes. Well, they never discovered me safe for I'm going to focus right up, haven't you? You've got to keep that picture in focus. That's, uh, what was that one over there? A sailor in the marine in the 16th, 17th century? 1664, yeah. 1664. I was hard, though. But I had some good money. Mm -hmm. There's the cat of nine tails with lead weights in. But the, la the entries in there is August 1807. To November. Mm. And over it's here, it's over it's here is a diary. Right? Oh, the Captain John Edgecombe of the Marine. In the back is a list of the crew of HMS Adventure who were murdered by savages in Queen Charlotte Sound in 1773 during Captain Cook. Part of the entry reads the officers and cutters crew of the event, they were all eaten except a head or two. Trouble began when I got back to Bolton. Your muskets. Oh, let's right Wessex helicopter in northern Norway in 1982. Mm -hmm. Goes through the, the Arctic, Arctic snow. Right. Cool, they've even got it refrigerated in here. It's, it's all cold. cold as well in here. It's like outside on the beach. <laughs> it's a snow hole look, built in the snow and ice. You've got to feel the temperature as well, is the thing. Yeah, it's really cold. Yeah, it's old. There's the, um, the marine all dressed out ready for action. The old, this is uh, my old mate, old Bell, yeah. All right, Bell? Yeah, all gay. <laughs> Standing beside you, watch what you say. You've got a lot of camouflage. Here's the UDA loyalist prisoners of war. The painted emphasis made by a UDA prisoner in the Crumlin Road prison. This is the old officer's mess. using the first road wall. There's a Luger on the left and a Webley on the right. That's the first road wall section. The old Lewis gun down there. A couple of Vickers. There's Brent gun over there. Up there, shoot up with man. Yes. They're filming up there next week. London's burning. Oh, that's up there. Yeah. So when you see, when you see this picture on the yeah. video, you'll see the same as what they're. Oh, uh, London's burning. All their marches up there. They're going to make that a, a college. Uh, and uh, that block there. They're going to use. Yeah. So next week you see all London burning. Very good though, this museum. Yeah, very good. Yeah. Should be better in the next couple of years. 
defeat. Awarded for. It was the Falling. British invasion in January 1810 that involved James Jones, now a sergeant on board the 16-gun sloop HMS Asp. Through accident and injury, Jones found himself the sole NCO on board and clearly played an important part in the landing. Helps, as it happened by a company of Royal York Rangers that had embarked the ship as she passed through Antigua. The third and fourth classes of medals were for both actions, which were operations involving sailors and marines moving. What's going after that?